It's been so long. It's been so long. I forgot what where, where do you look. Where do you look? Hey, I am doing a hair review on this wig. Y'all don't even know how excited I am. I got this bad boy on my head. So, um, this one is from April Lace Wigs. Now, I would like to do um, wig tutorials on cheaper wigs, right? Um, I'm trying to stay within maybe like the hundred dollar to or on the low price because I know they got some short wigs out there for like $80 so from like the $80 range to kind of like the 250 range you know what I'm saying um just reading like comments and reviews and stuff like that from other people a lot of expensive wigs out there you know you're gonna get good quality wigs with expensive wigs so but for those who don't have that much money I want to do something for us because I you know what I'm saying I'm not balling so I would like to do something to where everybody can kind of you know live the perks of the wig life so this wig is from April Lace Wigs and this one from what I saw some of them are really most of them are really expensive but I'm persistent okay and your girl caught a sale this one costs let me get the whole thing two hundred and thirty nine dollars and five cents on the sale so it's a Brazilian virgin it's 20 length color natural I did natural color um hair texture straight I hit it a little bit we'll talk about that straight um capsize medium hashtag she got a big head but I think I should have just small because I had to tighten it and it's a 360 wig density 180 so that's from the little card here now you're gonna get my nails in it uh uh-huh um uh, I'll just put it below if you don't want to, if you want to stay in your budget, um, but you want an affordable wig off top, if you don't even want to play the games, if you just want something good in quality that's going to last you a little bit, I would say go with this. If you're not used to doing like bonding it down, plucking the things, um, making a whole part, making your edges look good and all this other stuff, this is also the wig for you because I didn't have to do all of that. I definitely just did the bare minimum and I did it on purpose all I wanted to see if people aren't good at it can you still work with this wig and the answer to that is yes when I do the month update I will show you guys in its entirety so the lace the lace it is 360 all the way around um, and I it does have the adjustable straps and it also has combs in it density is there okay so the density is there I had to layer I'm not a big fan of long hair now you get your links work this thing this bad boy is right here so you definitely it was like here and I, I layered it so it's definitely um a little bit shorter in some spots but the, I, the, it doesn't shed I did um I think I got like a piece whatever a piece um it's so thick though that it's not it's not uh tangly that's not it if you're gonna have long hair and it's gonna have a density of 180 there's gonna be a certain type of natural thickness I guess that is gonna be there you don't get like a knot catch you just it's thick and once you kind of hit it a little bit with the um flat iron and kind of like loosen it up it's even better the curls ain't none I curled it twice and I had like some nice little luscious um body wave kind of curls and they just fell honey they they fell they gone now the and if you're in if, if you are like a hand free like how I'm doing if you do this a lot your curls ain't gonna make it honey I love the wig so much I don't care about no damn curls I don't even care about them curls set it with some curlers and probably do like an overnight thing you know what I'm saying and then you could probably see if it lasts longer and um yeah probably just try some different methods with it and i will try that since that didn't really work too well but other than that like honestly it's just a really nice wig 230 i forgot what i said 239 it's not bad um it's definitely not a hundred dollars but when you think about it put a hundred dollars aside every paycheck or fifty dollars honey you will be able to get this wig and you will be happy with this wig On your edges 
aren't gonna disappear in like a little bit. Um, two, what I also like is the fact that I don't have to completely move the wig all the way up to my forehead. It just makes me feel so uncomfortable sliding it all the way up above my baby hairs. It just it just kind of makes me not feel right in, in a way. If you're a perfectionist, you can still use some spritz. Go ahead and use some whatever to control your edge. And then um, spritz that bad boy down. Ain't no reason to make your life complicated, honey. Keep it simple.